Hi, I'm Dr. Ian Howell. I'm broadcasting from the Voice and Sound Analysis Laboratory at the New England Conservatory of Music in Boston. And I'm so happy to welcome you to our 2017 Mata Voice Synthesizer Grammy Awards. Every year in my voice science class, I challenge my students to try to create their own singing voice inside the Mata Voice Synthesizer. Now, for those of you who are familiar with this software, I only allowed the students to manipulate the formant frequencies and Q or bandwidth settings. I allowed them to manipulate the vibrato rate and extent settings, the pitch, obviously, and the spectral tilt, the roll off of the source spectrum, but none of them were allowed to mess with the little red slider. So they had to fine tune um, using all of those parameters. Um, we had two finalists this year who both did a great job, and so I'm gonna play you their samples. First, we have a tenor. And second, we have a soprano. And just to reiterate, neither of those samples were, were created by a human being. Those were both created um, exclusively with the Mata Voice Synthesizer. And in fact, here are the settings for the tenor. And here are the settings for the soprano. So any of you who teach voice pedagogy classes and use the Mata Voice Synthesizer um, to demonstrate maybe within your own lectures or even teach your students how to use the voice synthesizer themselves, I strongly encourage you to uh, consider using this assignment. It's great because it really allows the students to think about um, you know, all the various choices that one has to make within the Mata Voice Synthesizer to really capture the sound of a, a real human singer. Um, have a great day. We'll see you next year. Bye.